Friday around 9 o'clock a.m., I was serving the client's hair. When all of a sudden, my special friend Eugene came into the salon and he said, Yolanda, I need prayer. He said, I need you to pray and lay hands on me. Well, if you know Eugene, you know that he meant right now. So he's standing there with his beautiful blue eyes stretched wide and he's awaiting my next move. Shocked and exciting. All at the same time, he seemed serious about this. So I said to him, Eugene, I don't have to lay hands on you in order for God to heal you. But if you know Eugene, you understand that he was very adamant and he wasn't taking no laying on of hands for an answer. Gripping his chest with his hands, he continued to share with me that he was having severe chest pains and that he wanted me to lay hands on him and pray for him. And so as I continued to work on my client's hair and hear Eugene's repetitive requests, as well as listening for the Holy Spirit's instructions, doing this all at the same time, I asked him to sit down for a brief moment. Well, he did. And it be, and I began to ask him if he believed that God could heal him, you know, and I began to explain how powerful God is and that he's not limited to only laying hands to heal but that God can heal and deliver him from Chiral all the way to California, etc. <laughs> or however God chooses to do it. Well, I could tell that he was really listening. So as I still continued to work on my client's hair, I began to pray for him and release God's anointing power of healing to him from just a few feet away, but never laying hands on him. And he received it. Lastly, I shared with Eugene Isaiah 53 and 5 for him to speak over himself, which is by Jesus' stripes, I am healed. Well, later on that evening, somewhere around 5 o'clock p.m. or so, he came back into the salon for a snack pack. And I asked him, I said, Eugene, you know, how's your chest doing? How's your chest feeling? And he turned around with his big blue eyes lit up and he said, it worked. It worked. It worked. Can you say all praise be unto God? How many know revival is here and revival is now. Miracles after miracle after miracle is happening.